Cube, hey. Yo. Ice, welcome back. What's happening, man? We're now, just talking about Vanilla Ice, who is coming up in about 20 minutes. You see him get his ass kicked last night? Did he get his ass kicked? Oh, By dude. Todd Bridges. Oh, man. Todd Bridges <laughs> went into the ring soft as a uh, roll of Charmin, and I mean handed Vanilla Ice's ass to him. Oh. <laughs> he really exposed Vanilla Ice. We just got a letter from Vanilla Ice. And his publicist saying he wanted to be referred to as Rob today and not Vanilla Ice. <laughs> what about, you talking about, Willis? <laughs> how, about, how, about, how about you? Uh, what, what, can we call you Ice Cube or do we, should we call you your real name? Call me Cube, man. Cube. Hey, hey Cube, Cube, if you were on Celebrity Boxing, yeah, one celebrity you'd like to step in the ring with? One celebrity I'd like to step in the ring with? Um... Hmm. I don't know, man. I, don't, I mean, it, it's a couple of executives that I like to step in the ring with. <laughs> Not really no celebrities, you know, but I love to step in the ring with a couple of these executives I work with. Hey, here's a question. Which are worse to deal with, movie executives or record executives? Movie executives. Why is that? They, they just want everything. I mean, they, I mean, they think they're like in a fraternity or something. You know what I'm saying? They, they, just, they just so guarded and, you know, you can't really even... Talk to him a lot, you we, know. We it's had funny. we had Harry Shearer, uh, who's one of the voices of The Simpsons. We had him on yesterday, and he was talking about this. And he said the reason they suck is because they suck, but don't know they suck. Yeah, they're you like, know they like they they like in an office building somewhere on Wilshire, right? You know, Rodale Drive office building. Right. They're gonna tell me what the hell's going on in South Central Los Angeles. That's just, that's just <laughs> right. not gonna happen. They're gonna tell you what street. Well, Cube, we see it like this. Yeah. Uh huh. I'm like, man. <laughs> uh huh. Well, you've done some really fantastic work, and I mean, what what was your very first uh, role on film? Boys in the Hood. It was yeah. Boys in the Hood. I didn't know if you had done anything before that. When you saw Boys in the Hood for the first time, you saw yourself acting on screen. Did you say, you know, that's actually not so bad? Or did you say, oh, that's terrible? I, I said, you know, that's not so bad. I wasn't all the way happy with it, but uh-huh. I wasn't I wasn't all the you know, I wasn't uh, shattered by it. You were pretty good in that, though. You I have to tell excellent. you, you were very good. Who was it that I just saw that I didn't realize was in that movie that's huge now? Was it Dulé Hill? No. Was he in that movie, the guy from uh, West Wing? Was it Cuba Gooding? Was he Cuba in there? Cuba Gooding is in the movie. Yeah, Cuba okay. Gooding's in there. Yeah. Lawrence Fishburne is in the movie. Right. I knew Angela he was Bassett, Morris Chestnut, you know. Some good you, stuff. You know what's amazing about Lawrence Fishburne? That dude was in Apocalypse Now. Exactly. He was 14. I mean, my 14? God. 14 in Apocalypse Now, stayed in Vietnam two years to shoot the movie. Isn't that unbelievable? Damn. Yeah, Ta- or where Philippines, wherever the hell they went. No, nah, yeah, they were somewhere, and uh, in fact, they had to reshoot a lot of that because, like, a bunch of it got destroyed, and, and they brought in. Remember, uh, Martin Sheen was the second. Originally, it was uh, who played that role at first, and then they brought in Martin Sheen. Forgot who it was, but uh, man, it was somebody you wouldn't even think. It was like Harvey Keitel or something. Yeah, Harvey Keitel. Guys. We're talking Ice Cube. Uh, I was just reading a thing in uh, an entertainment magazine. They were commenting on how a lot of these, like, kind of boy bands, like, you know, NSYNC and uh, uh, Backstreet Boys, now the thing is to go out on stage with somebody that's got real cred, you know, to oh, try yeah. to make to try to make them cooler. Like you'll see nah. you'll say you'll see them out there with you know like Snoop or whatever. Yeah, that's kind of. I mean, who who's really benefiting? I mean, do, do, do you think the rapper kind of is that is that a bad thing for them to be doing? Lesser's himself. Well, you know, some rappers are under the misconception if they uh, do that, they'll get more fans. But you know, I don't think so. I don't think you should. Crap. I don't think you should be out there with a band unless you dig the band. Would you do a, a duet with InSync? No. 
<laughs> no, 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 no amount of money, huh? <laughs> No. no, because, you know, I'm not into that music. It's not uh-huh. all about the Benjamins when it comes to that. What is going on with your music? Oh, right now I'm changing labels. You know, I've been are on you? Priority, which, you know, they like the indie. So I've been I've been over there for, for too long. Now it's time to kind of, like, get with a major and uh, do it in a major way. Is there still that whole East Coast, West Coast thing there was back, you know, back when, uh, like, when Tupac was shot? And at one point it was uh, it was a real... I guess war has that died down, or is there still a lot of animosity? I don't think it's animosity between the rappers, mm-hmm. between the entertainers. I think it's a lot of animosity between the industries. Really? Uh, yeah, you know, a lot they're of trying to fuel that things. Like they're trying to on. fuel that to sell records. You think? Well, I think uh, you know most of our outlets come from the East Coast. Our mm-hmm. musical outlets, uh, MTV, BET, all the things where we get to pump our. Mm-hmm. music on and what happens is you know i just think they're fans of east coast records right more than they're fans of of west coast records so then you see more east coast records getting played and the east coast groups you know uh they get larger quicker than yeah west coast groups i mean i mean who's large from the west coast besides me dre and snoop you know what i'm saying and a couple of other people uh, uh, everybody else is kind of like almost there, but not really, you know, over the top. Right. All the big ones do seem to yeah. be East. Yeah. That's because all the outlets come from there. You Man, know? that's the celebrity boxing I want to see. East Coast rappers versus the West Coast rappers. Nah, you know, because then you might, you know, you might, guns might get pulled out. I was going to say, <laughs> you know, you somebody, know? <laughs> somebody's going to pull out. Hey, oh, yeah. I don't know too many ones just take it on the chin in front of the national audience. No. Can you imagine the posses that would roll in from each corner? There would be so many people Please. on the corner, more than in the stands. Man, you know, so uh, <laughs> I don't know if you want to see that, because that might spill out into the street. Can All right, I, man, thank you, Cube. Bye, All right. Can, hold can hold I call on you, one second. Can I call you Holmes? No, nah, oh. call me Cube, man. All right, Cube. Hang, hang on, Hang man. on, Cube. It's Ice Cube. What's up? What you tell him? I just told him we were smoking, man. And we were just chilling. Man, you were smoking. I got smoked half a little piece of joint with you. Man, that fool ain't gonna do nothing. What'd he say? What'd he say? All right, man, he said if we don't pay him by 10 o'clock, he gonna bust the cap in both our ass. We need to pay him, man. He crazy, man. Let's stick together. I can't believe you got me in the mix with this fool. Oh, man, I ain't put that joint to your lip and make you smoke it. Might as well. Come on, Craig, man. Stimulate your mind, man. It's Friday. I'm gonna get you high. You're listening to the best of the Morning X. You can also catch it on the Morning X podcast, wherever you get your podcasts, or at 99x.com.